Hello, boys and girls! It's me, Halsas T, and we are back with Season 2 of the Hardcore Challenge. Season 1 was a bit short-lived, did not even make it uh, uh, three proper episodes uh, before we died to uh, baby zombies. But the one thing I learned from that is... Avoid zombies because especially in hard mode uh, they can spawn in reinforcements which can make your life quite difficult. But we have spawned here in a flower forest uh, with uh, meadows, hills back there and a village over this side. So let's get on with it, on with it and uh, punch some trees again. And hopefully this time around we will last a bit longer. Uh, I think part of the problem was also that I actually ventured out into uh, into caves uh, instead of uh, sticking with branch mining. Branch mining is pretty safe when it comes to uh, to mobs, but uh, in these caves you can always come across uh, the uh, odd um, mob that will just get you. I mean, before we uh, died to the uh, uh, zombie, uh, or the baby zombie, uh, we fought some uh, some skellies. Uh, did not fare too bad against them, uh, because usually they have ranged weapons, and uh, that can be a bit of... Uh, of an issue because they can do damage to you uh, even before you can reach them to uh, to hit them with a with a sword. But we did manage, at least with the uh, skeletons. And um, last time we spawned in quite a, a similar area. Uh, not uh, a flower forest, but uh, a plains or uh, a open field. So we had a bit of an issue with uh, getting uh, wood to start us off with. But quite nearby there were... Um, there were... Ouch! I should not do that. Uh, but nearby there were two villages. So I have confessed uh, when setting this second season up, I did not take uh, just the, the first world that I generated. I wanted to have something similar, um, at least with uh, an open area nearby. And uh, the fact that there is actually also a village nearby, uh, that's a surprise. I did not see that when I had a quick look around. Um, but that's all the better. We don't need the tulip. So... Um, where was that village? It was over there. I think we do have enough enough wood. Um, let's make a few planks. Crafting bench. Um, and then we shall have a few sticks.
and this will do for now. Only has to last us a while, and if we can find ourselves a few sheep for the wool, um, that would be great. Um, quite a few chickens. So uh, let's get them also quite a few pigs. So we need something to uh, regenerate our uh, hunger. Uh, bee over there, but we cannot eat bees. So, better not touch the bee. It might get angry at us. It's down here. Over here we have some, some sheep. So, let's see if we can get, get us uh, enough wool for a bed. Because this is not the no sleep challenge. That was another Minecraft series I did recently. And down there is a big hole. Careful when going down. And over here we have the village. Hello. Um, you're dealing um, in level. I assume you do as well. And you. You are a farmer. More leather works. Okay, I I see what the main profession in this village is here. Um, we might change that. Ooh, apples. Apples is great. Bread is also great. Uh, we also will take the potatoes. There are cows over there and back there. So this is good. Um, and over here we have a bit of sugar cane. So, and once again, we have a four high sugar cane. They can spawn in like that, but uh, they cannot grow that high. So, let's plant a bit of sugar cane here along the shore, punch a bit of grass, so we can eventually also create a A bit of farmland. So let's make a bit of space here and this is a bit away from the from the village 
and when we will go mining we will head further away from the village so that if we are mining through the night instead of sleeping we do not actually uh, spawn in uh, uh, hostiles so let's craft that bed and go to sleep ah that feels so good um we will probably need quite a bit of um, of wheat and as we saw from the farmer there they have a carriage trade so carrots will be another thing that we want and seeing that they have quite a few uh, uh, leather workers we can uh, trade leather for emeralds so that's oh a bit of dirt here and then we can plant a bit of seeds and it is a nice addition that you can actually hoe dirt in this update and you don't have to wait uh, for it to become grass but that's it for the, uh, the first hoe so let's see if we can get a few more seeds yep just like that collect all of them it's not much but it will give us a start unfortunately they will not grow not while we are not in uh, the uh, area as they need a player nearby So I would say let's pack up. Um, I have a bit of chicken. Not much food. We will cook it up once we get a, a furnace going. Uh, don't need the egg so let's stay with chickens because they also drop feathers and head in this direction where it is a bit uh, hillier and the good thing of uh, having hills ooh, it goes down there is that um, higher up you find a bit more coal and coal is basically the the first thing we want yep a bit of leather out of there
and that was my X. So here, here at the top of a grassy hill, village is back there. So I think we want to dig in here and then go in this direction away from the village, which is negative X. So just so to remember. Right here at the start, um, we have a bit, uh, we are lacking cobblestone, but later on, we will probably not have or have more than enough. So. Uh, let's craft that furnace. Then let's um, have three wood locks in there. Go steep. These are the kind of things that uh, I want to avoid. And then we shall craft ourselves a pick. Nice. And we shall have a sword and let's melt a bit of meat. And as I do have um, the Optifine um, installed uh, holding a torch uh, actually lights up the uh, area um, not uh, a safeguard against mobs but uh, it helps with uh, visibility and I already can here, zombies, and we have a hole down there. So maybe we will choose another hill, hopefully, another hill that actually has more coal. I don't have an axe. So stone will have to do. So let's head over there. Gray sheep, more sheep. Let's be careful so we do not drop down. Uh, 
Okay, this is quite kind of a nice cave. So let's make another start here. Dig in a bit. And we have another cave system, but at least here, we're going into the open again. Here we have a bit more coal. That should give us a good start. And it's going night time again. So let's call this a successful first episode where we did not die, which is all that matters. So see you soon in the second one. Goodbye.